so excited. Yeah, me too. Because I don't even think you've seen me with makeup on. Yeah, no, not like that. Like, I'm glad you're letting me do it. Right? Yeah, that looks good. And then you get my face. Looks, like, oh my, I look like a kid next to you. Dad, oh my god, my face my head is so big. Let me oh my god. Welcome back to my channel, guys. Today I have a brand new video, another day of Vlogmas, and I have Asia here today. Hi, guys. She's starting a YouTube channel, so keep an eye out for it. Do you have a link yet? Yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah, so I'm gonna link it below. Subscribe. Content's coming soon. We actually have a mukbang that's gonna be out eventually. Yes, Rich on Twitter. my page. Ooh, so mm -hmm. look out for that, guys. Yeah. So today, she is turning me into an IG baddie. Yes, oh are you God. excited? I'm so excited. I've never, since I met her, I've never seen her in a full glam. Mm -mm. So I'm honored that you chose me to and be she she does a full, full beat. Like, she just looks on point. Please stop. I'm, just a disclaimer, I'm not a makeup artist, but I do love makeup. Mm -hmm. So, you know, let's let's go. I'm, I'm, I'm ready. Are you ready? Yes. Okay, so first thing I'm going to do is prime your face. Okay. I'm using the e.l.f. Uh, Portis Putty. Should we go over topics while we do this? Yeah. Hmm. We can talk about friendship breakups. Yes. Oh my god. I have, so, I have too many of those. Me too. I don't know if, I'm, if it's a good or a bad thing. Mm. Is it usually your fault or their fault? Honestly, it's never really my fault. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna be honest with you and I'm not even saying that. Like, just people are not like, take advantage of my kindness, you know? Yeah. I'm a really nice person, laid back, sweet, loyal. Mm -hmm. And people like see that and like, okay. And I had a bunch of girlfriends that I went to like elementary school with and mm -hmm. stuff, but we were really close. And um, these are all Ashley's makeup, by the way, so you know. Also, I yeah. flinched, just gonna warn you. Yeah, you flinch? <laughs> yeah, you might notice me going like that when you touch my face. It's, it's like it's fine just keep doing your thing i don't know like throughout high school they kind of changed things went different we weren't as close as we were like we were in elementary school right so um one day we all went to halloween haunt at wonderland you remember you oh my that? god that was a thing to do mm -hmm. we went to halloween haunt and me like my best friend at the time we were like um we separated ourselves the other girls went one way and then me and my best friend went another way mm -hmm. um at the time was she in the group too? Yes. Okay. But she, like me and her were closer than, than the rest yeah. of the group. So it was time to go and she, my best friend didn't want to leave. She, there was a guy there that she liked. She didn't want to leave. Okay. Which is understandable. You know, we're in high school. Mm -hmm. You know, you, you find a guy that you like. And then after the girls ended up waiting for us, like at the front, because we're not supposed to at this point. Mm -hmm. They waited us for like probably a good 20 to 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. Which is annoying, right? Like you come with people, you guys want to leave together, so you're waiting and you're just ready to go home. Oh yeah, because everybody gets a ride mm -hmm. or buses together or something. Mm -hmm. So they're waiting, they're waiting, they're waiting. So we get to the front of the gate and guess who everybody's mad at? Me. Oh my God. Everybody put the blame on me that I held them back and we ended up missing the last go bus. So we were stranded at Wonderland <laughs> and it was my fault. And at that age, everyone's broke. Everybody's so broke. They can't take a taxi. So then after everybody, like we ended up having to walk to a Tim Hortons that was probably like 15 minutes away. 15, about, yeah, about 15 minutes away. And we're just sitting in there and everybody's just being so rude to me. Like, oh it was so bad. And like, we're all supposed to be good friends. Even my best friend, she's just sitting there while everybody's getting she at me. She didn't stick up for you? She didn't say oh, anything. She didn't say shit. She didn't oh. say nothing. So everybody's getting at me and I'm sitting there by myself taking it. And I'm a hothead, guys. Like, mm -hmm. I was like, I don't even know if I could put this on the internet, but what I was what was going through my mind, we're in Tim Hortons, okay? <laughs> and you see the boiling like hot kettle of coffee? I was thinking, oh, like, I was just, <laughs> girl, I was thinking some crazy stuff. Cause like I don't like to feel gang up ganged up on, you know, just just not my thing. I don't like pe seeing people being, being ganged up on. Mm -hmm. I hate it. So then after they're like, oh, you have to call your mom to come pick us up because mm -hmm. you're the one who holds us back. And I'm like, it wasn't me. I'm like, nobody's believing me. I could not believe she didn't stick up for she you. She didn't say nothing. She's with my best friend. That's why. Yeah. So then after I was telling my mom the situation, my mom was pissed because she had to get up out of her bed. It's like 12 o'clock at night. My mom's a, a PSW, so she's oh, tired. She has to gone. work. Yes. And she was so mad. Nobody said anything in the car. I was telling my mom everything that happened. And then eventually, like I'm the type of person, like when I think about everything that goes on, mm -hmm. I get more angry. I but like, oh over yeah. time. Oh yeah. girl, like it gets bad for me. Like it gets really bad. So got to a point where we I ended up calling them on the phone and being like, hey, listen, what you guys did was wrong, blah blah blah. And we started yelling on the phone. It's like, come to my house right now. And it's and it's so funny because the girls are like literally probably like five minutes away from like oh five minutes away from me. God. So we're just yelling on the phone and we had a big fallout, man. And it's like even me and that after that day, so we all went to the same high school. Mm -hmm. And I was so I was grade 10 at this time. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of going all over the place, but I was in grade 10. And I was over it. I was over it. I was over my best friend. 
at the time, quote unquote, I was over the girl, so I ended up switching schools. Oh my god! And I ended up switching schools, and I didn't tell anybody until I got in. And then after, guess what? I turned victim. I turned um, the enemy again because I didn't tell my best friend I was leaving school. Oh, so now you're the evil bitch. <laughs> I'm, the evil, I'm the evil oh, bitch. Oh yep. my god! Because I didn't tell her. So yeah, like little stuff like that, you know. It's like I was like she knew what I was going through at that school. Like she was like literally my only friend. Like that's crazy. Yeah, just little stuff like that. Like you know, and it's just like so unfortunate because we we're so close growing up. And it's like, I think they had a built up anger towards me. And at that point is when it really came out, their true colors. I don't know how they just like sit there and don't believe you when you're telling them something and that girl can't defend you. Oh. It's like, it, Cause it wouldn't escalate. All she has to do is like, guys, I'm so sorry. I'm yeah, like, like, you know, have my back or something. And like, it was her fault why we didn't even, uh, we, we were late, we were missed the bus. Did she even end up with that guy? No, <laughs> definitely guess. not. Of course not, crazy. Yeah, but you know, it made me stronger. I never, that never, I never let myself get inged up on again, trust Good. me. <laughs> At that point, I, like now that I think about it, I should have just left all them and get my mom to me up on myself. Yeah, right? But, but then now, I don't know if your mom would even. My mom wouldn't allow that. Yeah, because no. when you're young girls, no, moms yeah. can't do that type of Yo, stuff. Yo, your, your face is flawless. Oh my girl. God, I'm so excited to see it. I'm not going to look at it at oh, all. Oh yeah, I know. We're not, we're not letting you look. Yeah, even if I look at the viewfinder, I'm blind, so. How about you? It. Do you have any like? I have so many friendship breakups. Like, I think my worst friendship falling out was. Um, long story short, she got into some like witchcraft and satanic type of stuff. Stop it! I had some weird friends. Like I had to cut off friends because they were coke addicts, because they were demonic, oh because they're strippers, and they're, they're, their their drama was interfering with my life. But yeah, mm -hmm. this one, she was um, very very demonic and like I had to literally like call her and break up with her and say like I can't be around that type of energy anymore like there's some weird shit happening and I feel off and like you have like the satanic book in front of me at my house like I can't do this anymore and I literally had to cut her off wow yeah I couldn't do it I was like I, I just can't like listen like everybody has their beliefs but like this one I need to stay away from this way yeah yeah so oh my okay oh my god speaking on the French like on the whole friendship thing right mm -hmm. So I was on TikTok and I seen, you know, remember Bumble, the dating app? Yes. They have Bumble oh. BFF. Yes! I downloaded it oh last year. I downloaded it like when, like yet last night. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh my God, this is so interesting. Yeah. And I'm like, this is so cool. You can actually go meet girlfriends. I'm like, yes. I and I'm just, it just dawned on me. It's like, why is it so hard for girls to make friends? It's so hard. <laughs> like, that's like, why when I click with people, I'm just like, wow, like this is new. What the fuck? Yeah. It's so hard. There's another app called Hey Vina. And I downloaded that last year too, but there's a lot of like, just like small talk and then you just like never meet up. I'm gonna let me call you in actually. Okay. And um, it's a cool app though. It's a really cool oh, concept. It, I met like two girlfriends on there. I'm like, oh, oh cool. my god. I'm like, this is actually cool. But then after it's like, okay, now you guys get to message each other. What do you even say to this person? Like, Yeah, cause it's so different than dating. So different. Like so online, different. have you ever online dated? No. Me neither. I, okay, I, okay. Do you remember the app Periscope? Um, the live streaming app? Yes. Yeah. Okay, so I used to have Periscope and like I was doing pretty good on it. Like I was getting numbers. And oh, yeah. I remember you remember you told me? Yeah. And after there's this guy that was there, he's from Houston. Mm. He's super cute. We like were talking for a bit. We sent each other like, you know, naughty pics on Snapchat. Oh, my God. Oh, my gosh. Like that was the closest I ever got to like online dating though. And then mm. it turns out that his ex girlfriend is crazy about him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> freaking crazy and um yeah she stalked me and like was causing so many problems and it's like we weren't even dating but like she was like oh are you talking to this girl she caused a whole bunch of problems a girl her. from toronto like how are you gonna be mad of her girl in her country girl you're sad you're mm -hmm. a sad case and they were broken up at this time but like the way she's going on That's you think that yeah you, the way she's going on you would think that they're married have you heard of that dating app um raya no what is that about it's for verified like people or like celebrities youtubers influencers are you serious yeah so like a lot of people oh sorry stop smiling no no you're good you're good you can stop um, a lot of people go on there that are like um youtubers and they can meet like ball players and like rappers and celebrities on there are you serious? yeah you have to get accepted to raya you have to get referred to it first and then accepted into it by the app itself Wow. And you can be on a waiting list for like two years and then get accepted. Are you serious? Did you apply for it? I did. I did. <laughs> and? and I'm on the waiting list still. What's the tea? Nothing. I can't see anything. I really oh want to see what's on there. But yeah, so like when you get on the app, mm -hmm. um, you have to like sign the contract, D signature, whatever apparently. Mm -hmm. And you cannot screenshot. You can't tell anybody what's on there. You can't talk about it. You can't do anything. Otherwise, you can get kicked off and you can get sued. 
They did? Yeah, it's very exclusive because there's like top, like A-list celebrities on there. Wow. Yeah, it's very interesting. I really want to see what, what it looks like. So are you waiting to get accepted now or you said you got accepted? Sorry. No, I was on the waiting list. Mm -hmm. um, I deleted the app once Shane and I got back together. Oh yeah, because you, you didn't need it yeah. at that point. But like if I ever get an email saying I'm accepted, I'm going on and looking. You have to. I'm, I'm you, gonna go on and You look. have to, just for the sake yeah. of just curiosity to yeah. see who's on there. Like I'm not gonna go match and talk to people, but I'm going to like just create because I really want to see what's on there. But oh right, friendship, friendship breakups. Yes, <laughs> yes. Okay, so do you think that friendship breakups are as hard as regular breakups? Depending on the person. No. No? Mm, okay, it depends on how long you've been friends for. Right. That has a lot to do with it because honestly, like nowadays, friendships don't even last a year sometimes. So but um, it depends. I think relationship breakups are, breakups are harder. They're so tough. Do people grow out of friendships too? Mm -hmm. So it's kind of just like, uh. Worst is when they like kind of leave you for their new boyfriend. Mm. Oh my gosh, yeah. So whack. My my good I honestly like I'm I'm very I'm a very understanding person. Mm -hmm. So in college like I had the like, um, a best friend, like my best friend. Um, we we're so close. We did everything together. I used to sleep over her house. Her mom knows me. But it was just a big thing, you know? Mm -hmm. And then she got a boyfriend that I actually like encouraged her to start talking to. Tell me girl how I never see my friend again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I never see my friend again, but I try to be understand. At first, I was super upset about it. Like, I was kind of bitter, you know, I'm kind of just like bitter and stuff. To the point where it's like when I had parties and she wanted to bring her boyfriend, and I'm like, nah, you can't bring your boyfriend. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, literally. I was like salty, but I'm like, you know what? That's not a good attitude to have. And, and then I got my boyfriend. And then I understand, like, I understand why now. In the early days, it's very hard to not be with your boyfriend every single day. It's so hard. It's so it's hard. It's so weird. It's the like, hardest thing. It's like, especially when you're with him, like Jonathan, I'm with him like practically every day, we do everything mm -hmm. together. So little days when he like leaves or has to leave for a long period of time, I'm a hot mess. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm literally a hot mess. What's it like living with your boyfriend? Like what was the biggest transition with that? It wasn't that bad. It's not that bad. Like I was looking forward to it and like, uh, I don't know, the things that mostly like worried me was cleanliness. I know, I'm terrible. You know what I'm saying? And like. John is luckily very clean, thankfully. Mm -hmm. But you know, he's a guy still. You know, they pee sitting up and you know, mm -hmm. little stuff like that. He is always playing with his hair, so there's hair everywhere. <laughs> I mean, I have weed, but like. No, she needs the same weed though. He rips his hair out. Girl, in the, in the shower, when I'm about to hop in the shower, all I see is oh freaking. It's the worst. It's actually the worst. It's like, what can you do? This is what we set ourselves up for. Okay. The liner is like the straight part, so. Oh, wait, shower. are we recording? Okay. That's what I'm talking about. I really want to see it. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Okay, so your wig. Yes. It looks so good. Faker? Did you pluck it and bleach it, bleach the knots and everything like that? No. I, my, my girlfriend did it for me, and then after I installed it, I did the, the open your eyes one. I did, did the, the wig cap method? Yep. Oh my god, please tell me you filmed it. Uh, no, I didn't, because I tried it out, but I'm going to film it. Oh god, I got a blank. It actually looks so good. Thanks, girl. Ooh, who's that? Oh my god, I can't wait to see it. I'm so excited. I tried doing wigs like that before, mm -hmm. and it just came out the most flaky shit ever when I did the wig cap method. Really? Oh my god, yeah, I did it, and I got it on the first try. And man, it was so hard though. I was like nervous doing it. How long does it stay on? You can keep it on for a minute. Is this the same install that you did in that video? Mm -hmm. What? Mm -hmm. I just had to like re glue it quickly because I was in a rush, oh but like god. it was the same thing, yeah. Same thing I did. So hopefully, you know, but I'm gonna take it off soon because it's making me hot as hell. What do people have to look forward to with your vlogmas? Oh my God. Let me have some ideas. People should give me some ideas. First of all, if anybody <laughs> has any prank ideas for Shingy, oh my God, we gotta do Please a tell me, I'm really trying to prank him, but we DM can. it to me, he cannot be seeing it in the comments. We gotta do a prank on Shingy. We have to, like, I really wanna get That's him. Funny. Um, we want to do some videos, um, Asia and I, we want to do some like fun Christmassy themed ones. And then I want to do some, I don't know, like more vlogs, but it's just so hard because um, there's nothing to do. Everything's closed. Yeah, that's so hard. Nothing is literally open. I'm a yeah. blush girl, I love my blush. I love blush. Uh, so don't mind me. I love that you put it on the nose, it's my favorite. Yeah. Did you teach yourself makeup? Yep, you too. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So I'm Reezy. How is the best one? Ooh. Did we do brows? I forget. No, not yet. We're gonna do that. 
browser so hard to do yeah. in other people oh, sometimes. Yeah. Oh yeah, but I got you. Good girl! I'm so you need excited. To do, you need to do a full beat more often. I'm gonna need you to take pictures of me, please. I got you. You know I've been really into? Um, feathered brows. I'm so, I love it. I love it I so much. I love it so much, but the thing is I got my eyebrows on braid. So it's like, like not the, not it's different from Michael Blading. It's more makeup. It's more mm -hmm. like a makeup look. Like do you a have product thick. on right now? I do. I have a little bit of product on, but like I'll show you a video. It's mm -hmm. kind of like you draw your eyeballs that stay on forever. Oh, like the kind of like the tattoo brows. Mm -hmm. My mom has those. She got yes. like, she got those in the 80s, so they're blue now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, a lot of people got it. I know, all Hispanic women, they have blue eyebrows. My grandma had them too. Do you have any tattoos? I want. You don't have any? No. What do you think about getting tattoos with your boyfriend's name? Hell no. I'm, okay, the, the most I'll go, the most I'll go is like initials. I know. Like I've seen like initials like in the sense where it's like, I'll put like uh, maybe a J in like my yeah. finger or something. I would maybe do like an S, but in another uh, yeah, so in like they, another language. Yeah, like exactly. I'll get my kids maybe, but I'm not a tattoo person. Yeah. No, I'm too indecisive. Like if I want one, I know in a, in a year I'll be like, fuck, I wish I didn't get this. I love tattoos like crazy. I'm an artistic person in get? general. Like I'm obsessed with oh, is that zodiac signs. So mm -hmm. I'm definitely gonna get Leo. my <laughs> yeah. I'm definitely gonna get the Leo sign mm -hmm. going on me, but that would be cute. Yeah. Make sure your eyebrows look like. Sisters, because they won't be twins, but you know, we're gonna get them as close as we can. Remember when highlighter was like the biggest thing and everybody put it everywhere? Everybody, yeah, and then now it's like it's taboo to put highlighter everywhere like that mm -hmm. anymore. Like, nobody really does that, right? I'm gonna try something I've seen where people use eyeshadow for a lip liner. Okay, so we're gonna try it on you. You know, I never wear a lip liner. Yeah. Cute. <laughs> okay, and just put them together, and then final. You can roll them together a little bit harder. There we go. Okay, let's. Ooh, ciao. Oh, oh my god. I really want to see it. It's cute. You look good, girl. You want to put the gloss on? Put the lip gloss on. Yeah. Me. Yeah. Put that. Oh, Ashley. Oh my god. Ashley, your face. I need to get pictures. Jeez. I already know I look good. Yo, you look fire. Oh my god. Oh my god, I can't believe I did that. <laughs> New career so coming upset. up next. <laughs> oh my god. Yes, you look good, girl. I can't see shit. <laughs> wow, let me spray your face. Good to go. You can go look. Let's get you up here. Oh my god, I'm nervous. nervous. I'm not nervous, I'm excited, but like. I haven't seen myself here. with makeup in so long. There you go. Okay, bigger Watch reveal. Hand. Bigger reveal. It's a little messy in my mirror, but. Okay. Oh my god! <laughs> Girl. <laughs> Wait, oh my god. Ashley, you look good. I looked in the mirror like, who the fuck is that? Oh my god. You look like a little, little body. body. <laughs> what? You oh my like god. I can't. Whoa, my I skin can. looks perfect. I can't. I can't. Oh my god, I have lip liner. This is crazy. Yeah, girl. Tell me. Bitch, who is this? Or <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my god. Girl. I don't even recognize myself. <laughs> you Girl, killed you it. Look I don't know who I am. <laughs> like, what? You look good. Oh, shit. You look really good. I'm loving this look. I need to recreate it for myself, honey. My cheekbones. Girl, you got cheekbones to the what? No, you gotta show me how to do that. I got you. Like, I wish I brought an outfit. No, I gotta post this. Oh my god, I yeah. Your, your, your face looks good. The ring light and <laughs> the ponytail. I'm gonna put the ponytail yeah, on. You gotta, you gotta take some pictures of this. I wanna see what it looks like in camera. Oh, this blush color. I don't even recognize myself. You look fire. I started out 17, now I'm like 29. Wow. I'm wow. Impressed. Okay, oh yeah. my god, thank you so much. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. She fucking <laughs> killed this shit. Yes. She killed it. Yes. Ooh. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that was Asia beat my face and turned me into an IG baddie. Ooh. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to subscribe. Comment, like the video, and if you want to see more looks like this and you want to see how she did it, I'm sure she's gonna post yeah, something on makeup I'll eventually. Post, so yeah. make sure to subscribe to her channel. I'm gonna link everything down below. Thanks, guys. How was it? How was doing my makeup? Oh, it was. She has the like the best face. Like, guys, take care of your skin. Mm -hmm. Super important. Like, you drink know, water. drink water, moisturize, use eye cream, all that. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next video. Yay! Bye, guys.